Hey everybody, what's up? Alright, so I'm making this tutorial today to show you guys how to install Industrial Craft. It's quite simple, once you get to know it, and uh, it shouldn't take long. So, as you can see right here, I got some uh, folders that I keep my backup uh, Minecraft.jars in. Ignore that. Uh, so here's a fresh copy of Minecraft.jar. You want to open that up with Renoir or 7-zip. I typically use Renoir. Close that. So now you got your Minecraft.jar right here. First off, delete your Meta INF folder so you don't have issues with that later. Now, we want to open up Mod Loader over here. Now, it's like, there's a 4 beside it because I have 4 copies of it and I just copied and dragged it into this folder that I keep my mods in. So open that with Renoir. And it's giving me the error again. I, don't know, I mean, the error, but the message. So just simply drag and um, select them all and drag them into your Minecraft.jar. And I'll give you this. Okay. Now close that out. Open up Mod Loader MP. And once again, select all. Drag and drop. Um. What's next? Industrial Craft. Now this one, there's a lot more to do. First, go into your Minecraft.jar. Uh, I mean, go to the Minecraft folder. Select all. You know, Control A, and drag and drop. Okay. Now go back. Go into your Industrial E Improved Pickaxe drag and drop okay now if you want the nano suit um, drag that in as well nano suit is just a really awesome piece of armor alright so now that we have that we want to go I believe to this folder yes go to your dot minecraft folder and you see how there's this industrial craft config text file? We want to drag that into here. See, I already have it there. If I can see. Config folder. Now, if I can open that up. Yes. Now, in your file, it should show enabled nano equals true with a pound sign next to it. So what you want to do is take away that pound sign and save the folder file trust me that has given me a lot of issues with errors the game crashing and whatnot that's pretty much everything that you need to know about installing industrial craft I have a shelf mod and a recipe recipe book that I didn't install it just tells you everything that you can make now I'm just gonna go back into my minecraft.jar folder and I'm gonna take out this jar and delete the old one and there we go now provided you did everything correctly it should load up and you won't get any weird screen errors well, that's it for now guys I'll see you next time in my let's play series with industrial craft